What's up, y'all? Um, we've been balancing some equations, and we're doing equations now. So here's a quick video on the five types of chemical reactions. And uh, here we go. There are five different types of chemical reactions, all right? And the first type I want to show you about is called synthesis. Now, to synthesize something means to make something. So a synthesis reaction would look something like A plus B makes a new compound, AB. And a good example would be like lithium metal plus oxygen gas. See, that's O2 because it's deadly 7. Lithium plus oxygen makes Li2O. That is a synthesis reaction, okay? <clears throat> then you would label that synthesis. And then you'd probably end up needing to balance it. Probably need a 4, 1, 2 there. Okay. Now let's try the next type. The next type is called decomposition. And you know what it means when something decomposes. Um, we could do this reaction in reverse. Right? You could say, okay, we had some lithium oxide. And it broke down into lithium and oxygen over a long period of time. That's it decomposing. And what do we say? That's two, four, one in that situation, right? And that's what it looks like when it's decomposing. So you can make something or you can break something. All right. Next type will be single replacement. All right. Single replacement. A single re re a replacement reaction is like you've got A, and then you have another compound BC, and you combine them. And then you end up with A being with C, and then B is by himself. So the first letter in the compound, that will be like the metal, and the second letter will be the nonmetal. So in this single replacement, the A replaces the B in this relationship, and now A is with C, and B is by itself. That's a single replacement reaction. Uh, one of these that we've done in class is uh, we took some copper, and we put it in some silver nitrate that was aqueous, like a solution of silver nitrate, and we ended up with copper nitrate, and then the silver was by itself. And if this is copper one, this is already balanced. One, 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 one. That's a single replacement. Let's try another type. Let's try something called uh, double replacement. These are really fun. These are when we can mix two, uh, two different uh, liquids in class and make like a solid that looks really cool. A double replacement. Let's say you have a compound AB and another compound CD and you mix them together and then the A ends up with the D and the C ends up with the B. See I always keep the first letter first. So now you have these two couples and something happens and now you have two new couples. They paired up. Uh, uh, here's a really popular uh, double replacement reaction a lot of science teachers do, a lot of chemistry teachers. We have some sodium hydroxide base plus some calcium chloride salt. These are both dissolved in water. They're aqueous. That's what the little AQ means. And then the sodium gets with the chlorine, sodium chloride, and that's aqueous because salt dissolves in water. And then the calcium gets with the OH. And you'll learn in class that calcium hydroxide, when you look on top of page 6, you'll see the calcium hydroxide is insoluble in water, so it forms a precipitate, and you'll be able to see it. So that's a good example of a double replacement reaction. Both of these metals were replaced and made new re uh, relationships. So that would end up being two one, two, one if we balance. And the last one is called combustion. 
The fifth type of chemical equation is called combustion. And that is basically when a fuel plus oxygen makes carbon dioxide and water. That's a combustion reaction. And this is a photosynthesis. Okay, this is plants uh, burning sugars. And when I say a fuel, it's got a carbon in it. Okay, here's a really good one. Let's say you have some methane gas, that's natural gas, and you light it so it combines with oxygen in the air. Then you'd see a flame, and that flame would produce carbon dioxide and water. And heat, it'd be very hot. We can just write that over there. And the carbon dioxide would be a gas. The water would be a, a gas form. It would be nice. It would be nice it would uh, humidify your room. But a gas plus oxygen makes carbon dioxide and water. And, of course, we could balance this. All right. And now we've got one, two, three, four oxygens over here. So we need two there. One, two, one, two. And uh, good luck with that. So here's what I'm going to have you do. I'm going to show you this. And I would say, okay, let's take a look at number one. Which one of those five types of reactions is number one? All right, you can pause the video and try it yourself. That, that's what I would do. All right, the first one, that is a combustion reaction. So you would just label it with the letter C. How about number two? Which type of reaction would that be? out of your five choices. Yep, aluminum is replacing iron, so that'd be a single replacement. How about number four? What type of reaction would number four be? You have hydrogen peroxide and it breaks down into water and oxygen. That's right, that'd be a decomp. How about number eight? What type of reaction would that be? Okay, yeah, that'd be a double replacement. Because here you have ammonium and phosphate and lead and nitrate. And then over here, the lead is with the phosphate and the ammonium is with the nitrate. Double replacement. Uh, and let's take a look here. Let's see. Well, off the top of my head real quick, I don't see any synthesis reactions on here. You can label that one again real quick. Yep, that's decomp. And uh, let's see. What do you think about number 10? Yep, that's combustion. And let me ask you about one more. What about number 15? What do you think that bad boy is? That's right, that's double replacement. That's the whole video. Just wanted you to watch that. Now, when you have any uh, videos in the future, any balancing problems in the future where you're balancing equations, over to the right, write what type of reaction it is, because that will be part of your test. Peace out. Wow.